Hello, this is Keith All, and in today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to create this transparent border, as you can see, uh, around um, your canvas here. So basically, we're just going to have an image, and then um, uh, and then we're going to create this uh, border that appears to be transparent, and of course, it'll have a drop shadow, as you can see here. So let's go over to a new canvas and let's drop in our um, image. Now I'm going to use the shift and alt key and then click and drag the bottom corner. And then press enter. Now we want to add a new layer above this image and we're going to use the rectangle tool to draw a rectangle around this image. Now you can press enter. It automatically fills it with uh, black because the foreground color is black. So now we're going to create another rectangle, but it's going to be slightly smaller. Okay, and now, and now we want to fill this with white. So if your background color is white, then uh, press Control Backspace and it will fill it in for you. Now you can press Enter to accept that. Now what we want to do is uh, select both of these layers by holding down the shift key and clicking on the bottom one and then we're going to right click and we're going to uh, rasterize the layers now since both of these layers are still selected we could use the shortcut key or right key or right click on it and we're going to merge the layers into one so now we're going to select the magic wand tool over here on the left and then uh, we're going to uh, hover over the white area and just click on it. And it creates a selection around that white area. Now all we're going to do is hit the delete key on a PC. And it reveals the image below it. Let's uh, control D as in David for deselect. And now what we want to do is we want to add a drop shadow now as you can see it created a drop shadow already uh, these are the um, settings that I had before so I'm just selecting normal blend mode black 100% opacity the angle is set at 120 the distance is at 3 pixels the spread is at zero pixel or percent, and the size is set at 27 pixels. So we're going to click OK there. Um, uh, let's go back in here, and we want to have a color overlay. So uh, now um, I'm going to set it to white. So let's click OK. Now we. we what we want to do is we want to rasterize this layer style. So you right click on that layer and select rasterize layer style. And now all we want to do is click on uh, the blend mode here and select uh, multiply. And there you have it. It appears that this is a transparent border and this is how you could do it in Photoshop. And of course, if you're an avid Photoshop user, you know there's more than one way to create this effect. Uh, thank you for stopping by today. Remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And click on that bell notification so you always get updated when I have a new video ready. And also, please like, share, and comment on my videos. It helps out the entire community here. Uh, so it helps me build uh, or make better tutorials 
and also if you have an idea for a tutorial uh, just comment below and I'll be sure to work on it for you thanks again for stopping by you have a great day and I'm gonna see you on the next video bye now